More than anything else, we want to interview you because of the name of your company. Okay, right. I'm just telling you right now. Yeah, so yeah. I have no idea what Food Marble is. Food Marble, yeah. But you're going to tell us, aren't you? Yeah. Okay. I, okay. I, okay. Like it's a little bit corny, but you know, everyone's digestive system's completely unique. And right, every marble, you know, like a marble, like when you're a kid. Okay. Like, yes. Yes. Every marble's unique. Right. 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 So, so I guess that's one of. That's one of our philosophies, right? Because every single person is completely different in how they digest food. And so we want, we want to enable people to, able, to be able to measure that, right? Just okay. make it a lot simpler. Okay, so what does food marble do? I mean, how does this yeah. process work? Yeah, so this, this device is measuring hydrogen levels on your breath. Okay. Okay, and that's a marker of how well you're absorbing the food that's passing through your digestive system, okay. right? And so it's based off an existing clinical technology, but that tends to be large desktop devices in the hospital. So we've reduced it down to a much smaller device, right? Because digestion happens slowly, and so you can't live in the hospital, right? So what we're doing is allowing people to do it in the home, you know, log what they eat, take the breath tests, you know, log any symptoms you're experiencing, and if you start seeing high breath readings, you can look back and see, okay, what was in that food, right? Because we've got a food database in the app, and so we know what components are in each of the different foods, and so you can see, okay, what are the likely culprits, you know? If it was a sandwich, was it the bread, was it the cheese, you know? So it just makes it a lot simpler for, for people to be able to join the dots. So, I, I see, so if you're dealing with maybe a food allergy, but you don't know what the allergy is, this will help, you know, it almost creates a science around it, so that you can start playing your own detective and, and figuring it out. Right, so technically it's not for food allergies because that, okay. that's like very, very directly you experienced the, the response and all the okay. history. But this is in, in the area of food intolerances. But, it, so, but really, you know, to most people it's, it's the, the same thing. But basically where you eat food and, you know, either, you know, maybe after an hour or two hours or a number of hours later, you start to feel unwell. And you're like, okay, what caused that? And you know, what was it in the food or gotcha. what else? Okay, so, yeah. okay. And your device is available right now? It's available right now uh, through our website, foodmarvel.com. It's $159, including shipping. We did over um, 8,000 pre-orders for oh, our wow. website. And so we're really thankful for all of those people who pre-ordered. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah. and, and so we're, you know, those people are starting to use the device, give feedback, and we really appreciate everyone's feedback so we can just keep improving the product, making it more and more useful for people, so, yeah. All right, and yeah. again, where do we find you? Foodmarvel.com. All right, this is your guru of geek, Marlo Anderson at CES 2019.